Hello, my name is Vinko. I'm an artist from South Australia. Welcome to my channel. Today we'll be doing a neo-traditional kind of style vase. I am doing this once again on Arches 300 GSM cold press cotton paper and I've already applied the background with a coffee or tea stain and I'm busy with the outlines at the moment. I start with the bolder outlines mapping out the main elements of the design to give them a little more power and using a finer line to do all the details. Once I remove the tape, I start the shading. For this project, I have used the Ecoline inks and a brush for the shading. This artwork was done a little while ago, 2020 if I remember correctly, and back then I didn't quite have a good grasp on the Ecoline, I was relatively fresh to this media, and that is why uh, I will be doing this artwork start to finish with the Ecolines for the shading and the color rendering. Nowadays I opt for the Copic markers purely for convenience, um, pack up and set down time is a little easier with the Copic markers. But I did have a really good time using these Ecoline inks. It's a little tricky at first if you haven't used them before, it's kind of like watercolor. A little different as well. It's a very fine balancing act and a bit of a time challenge. You have to wet the paper correctly and put enough ink on the page to get a nice smooth blend. But I do find once you find your rhythm, it, it goes quite quickly and it's a lot of fun and quite satisfying to look at the artwork come together. I do enjoy it. Nowadays, I find that I'm a little quicker with the Copic markers. But overall, this was a very fun media to work with. Trying to be quite delicate in these face details, trying to get a soft fade out, not to make it too dark or overwhelmingly heavy. I find that I'm a little more confident in these flowers by going in and putting a little punchier blacks in. I wish there was a little more of that in the face, but at the moment I'm, I'm quite enjoying how this is coming together. Now I start the color rendering once again with the Ecoline inks. I gradually build it up. Another reason why I was drawn to using the Ecoline inks is because I have a great appreciation for the traditional flash sheets. Um, and especially hand painted one like the spit shaded tattoo flash sheets they look amazing and I like those little inconsistencies of the blending as well as occasionally you'll get a bit of a water stain and those little details is really what what sells it to me for traditional media At the moment, I'm keeping the color scheme relatively traditional with the red, the yellow, the black, but I do eventually come in and put a pop of blue. Here we go. I feel like it breaks it up from those warm tones and just provides a, a little bit more oomph in the design. And just to balance it out a little more, the blue up the top, I put a little bit of blue in the face itself. Here we go with the final shots. I hope you enjoyed this process. If you did as much as I did, I would just appreciate if you liked and subscribed. And other than that, there's not much else. Until next time, stay creative.